Hello students, welcome to Saurav Sir's classes. The question is, in a class of 60, along with English as a common subject, students can opt to major in mathematics, physics, biology, or the combination of any two. So we have mathematics, physics, and biology. Six students major in both mathematics and physics. So six in both mathematics and physics. And 15 major in both physics and biology. But no one majors in both mathematics and biology. In an English test, the average marks scored by students majoring in maths is 45 and that of students majoring in biology is 60. So, let the students majoring in mathematics be X and in biology be Y. So, the average marks is 50. So, the total marks would be 50 into X plus Y is equal to 45X plus 60Y. From here, we get 5x is equal to 10y or x is equal to 2y. Because however, now I got this equation that 50 into x plus y is equal to 45x plus 60y. Because in the next line we have the combined average marks in English of students of these two majors is 50. So what is the maximum possible number of students who major only in physics? So we have that number of from this equation x equals to y. The number of students in maths is twice the number of students majoring in bio. Now since students majoring in both physics and bio is 15, so the minimum students who can major in bio is 15. So minimum students in maths is 2 into 15 is 30. So maximum students in physics is equal to 60 minus 30 minus 15 is equal to 15. Therefore the correct option is option D. The next question is if x greater than or equal to 5 degree and less than or equal to 15 degree then the value of sine 30 degree plus cos x degree minus sine x degree will be now cos 15 degree minus sine 15 degree can be written as cos 45 degree minus 30 degree minus sine 45 degree minus 30 degrees. We know that cos A minus B is equal to cos A cos B plus sine A sine B and sin a minus b is equal to sin a cos b minus cos a sin b. Therefore, Cos 45 degree minus 30 degree minus sine 45 minus 30 degree is equal to cos 45 degrees into cos 30 degrees plus sine 45 degrees into sine 30 degrees minus sine 45 cos 30 minus cos 45 sin 30 
so putting the numerical values we get 1 by root 2 into root 3 by 2 plus 1 by root 2 into half minus 1 by root 2 into root 3 by 2 plus 1 by root 2 into half. So this equals 1 by 2 root 2 plus 1 by 2 root 2 that is equal to 1 by root 2 which is equal to 0 0.71 so 0 0.71 is the minimum value of cos x minus sin x now sin 30 is equal to 0 0.5 Therefore, the minimum value of this expression would be 0 0.5 plus 0 0.71 that is 1.21 and above. So, the, so none of the above options are correct. So option E.